Secret Tiara to move up and the four four mares will be all in for trial seven. Lights on. And away they go, and from the inside, Tabuka anticipated the start, landed length in front, Secret Tiara gathers speed, so too does Morel, and in the lime green colours was It's a Man's World. So four across the track now as they work down the, uh, or heading towards the side of the track, and Morel took over to the lead, led by a half It's a Man's World running second, Tabuka third, and last of all, Secret Tiara as they work up a quarter mile to travel and using up plenty of the track it's Morello who'll turn in front about a length and a half clear it's a man's will Tabuka and also Secret Tiara who's going to be one of the widest runners down, down with 200 to go though and it's Morello who's in front it's clear it's out a length and a half Tabuka the inside it's a man's world and then Secret Tiara deep out in the track but Morello's just in front and Morello just give it a little squeeze near the line's going to score a little over a length to Tabuka second it's a man's will third and fourth in Secret Tiara they've gone 50.1 night. Three, one, two and five after trial seven. Three, uh, Morel the winner. A four-year-old uh, mayor by Westquest from uh, Waminda, a fearless pride mayor. David and Scott Brunton at Seven Mile Beach. Number three is first. David Fisher aboard. One, Tabuka second. Steve Brazendale, Sigrid Carr. And third to number two, it's a man's world, David and Scott Brunton for and Rhonda Mangan. So three, one, two, fourth in five. The breakdown, they're in 15.4 early. Home in 34.78. That's the fastest last 600 of the morning. And an overall time of 50.18, 50.18. It's three, one, two, fourth in number five. And the margins were a length and a half by a length and a half. One and a half both ways, three, one, two, five after.